Okay, this is the device. I'm going to replace the LCD. Okay. The first thing you have to do, you have to remove the keyboard. Separate it from this side. Just take out the keyboard from one side. Now you need to hit the, the screen. You hit it properly to remove the screen. You have to hit it right down. Okay, the connector is down this side. You have to very be careful. After you remove it, you have to slide the screen there. You will see the way I will do it. Okay, if you don't have data at home, you need to try to force to open it, but just open it slowly right down because you don't need this LCD anymore. So no need to, nothing for you to scale, but just be careful for the LCD connector from this side. Open it slowly and you try to raise it up, okay? If you have data, it's very easy to use it, make it more easy for you. Just hit it right down. So the glue become a bit weak, so you can able to manage to open the, the screen very easy. Just blow it right down like this. Make sure you blow it properly if you have the blower, so I can open it very easy. If you have the blower at home, you just try to open it slowly because you don't need this LCD anymore. But you have to be careful for the connector inside because you have to use that connector again on the new LCD. And the connector is from down this area. So you first open this and when you get to this, you have to do it slowly to open it. Make sure you hit it properly, okay? After I hit it, okay, now you just try to open it. You can see the glass all crack crack everywhere. Just try to raise it up. Open it right down. Screen is already cracked, so you don't need to scare. Just be careful for the connector. Screen already cracked everywhere. Everywhere is cracked. As you can see. Be careful for the connector down this side. Just try to open it. Skim already crack everywhere, so you just open it. Don't need to scare. Just be careful for the bottle also, and be careful for the connector down this side. Open it right now. No need to scare, just try to open it. Just be careful for your. Okay? Be careful for the glass. Just open it right now because the screen is crack, crack everywhere. As you can see, everywhere is crack. Just try to open it. Be careful for the connector. Be careful for your hands also. Mm -hmm. No need to worry about this because you don't need anymore. Just be careful for the connector inside. And be careful for your hands also. Okay, open it like this. Slowly, as you can see the connector down there. Okay, just open it like this. Be careful for this connector because you need it so badly. Okay, after you open the LC, be careful for this connector, okay? Then you take out this panel on top, this black one, just remove it. Okay, put it one side. Okay, then open the connector. You see the clip here, just this clip up. Okay, then you take out this connector, remove the LCD. Okay, now you need to disconnect all this connector here. You see how I will do it, okay? 
Now you need to clean clean all this half half glass right down before be careful for your hand. Okay, just clean clean all the glass right down. Clean it very nice to fix the new LCD. All this glass, you have to very be careful, you have to remove all slowly. Okay, be careful, okay? Make sure you clean it right down very nice before you put the new LCD, okay? After I clean this one very nice, okay, you put it one side, okay? Now you need to disconnect the connector and remove this small motherboard here. Okay, remove this panel on top. Put it one side. Disconnect the connector. Okay, and this clip here also, there's a clip here, you see top. Okay, remove the connector. Put it one side. Okay, then you open this panel here also. Okay, disconnect this connector here. Just access the clip up. This one to the clip. Remove the clip. Okay. Then you remove the connector inside. Okay, remove the connector inside here. Okay. Then you remove the motherboard. You have glue on that. Just set it up like this. Take it out, put it one side, okay? Okay, you fix everything on the new LCD. Make sure you fix this small motherboard, fix it very straight. Okay. Make sure you fix it very straight exactly how you take it. Make sure the connector is very straight. Okay. And you fix the connector inside, on this side. If you like, um, fix the connector first, so you don't miss the timing. Put the connector first inside very nice, like this, the one side. Make sure you go inside properly and close it. Okay, then you try to fix this other one also. Make sure the connector go inside here very well. Like this, go inside properly, very straight, squeeze it properly, then you close it. Okay. Then you put the motherboard now very straight, like this. Put the board very straight towards the connector side. Very nice. Okay. Then you fix this connector back. Push it inside. Very nice, like this, and close it. Okay. Put back this cover. Fix it very nice. Okay, fix the connector here also. Fix it very nice and squeeze it. Okay, and close this one. Okay. Okay, now you need to put the glue right on the top. Just put this right on very nice before you put the screen, okay? But before you do that, make sure you test the, the screen first. Connect it on the uh, everything. See that the screen is working perfectly before you put the glue right on and fix it. Because sometimes even the new screen is not good, okay? I already test my own mind. The screen is good. Now I need to put the glue right on. Okay, don't put on top of the camera and the sensor. Okay, just put it right on. Don't put on top of the screw, okay? Make sure you put it right on very nice at the edge. Like this, when you come this side, put at this side, don't put on top of the speaker that side. Okay, then you put here, make sure you put it right on. Put it right on, very nice, okay? After I put the glue right on, okay, then you fix the connector. Make sure you put it very straight. Okay, then you close it. Okay. Then you put this panel back also. Exactly, I take it. Close it very nice. Okay, then you put this one very straight, don't bend it. Okay, have a rubber like this. You can put that at least for 30 minutes so the glue become dry. Put here also. If you have a rubber like you can still use a slit, you just tip it for 30 minutes. So the glue will become there before you take it out, okay? Okay. Then you only to test the screen. 
it's not charged you can put on charge you put it on charge and leave it to charge now the LCD is fixed properly everything is okay that means okay hello guys if you like my video please subscribe to my youtube channel